Oh god, I hate it. <laughs> that's nice. It's like a little bit that's missing on the front here. It's weird. Okay, now we can see. All right, game two. You can see game one. Apologies for that. So our commentary was very not uh, in there because it's oh. hard for us to see. Wow, that was what? Okay, see that combo was really good, but since it was at the start of the game, he didn't have 11, so he didn't get to capitalize with 11 up there. Oh, I see. 45% though, uh, right out the gate is a lot really good though, because it also gives him his uh, 11 charge. Oh my god, he gets that? Charge shot into the grab? Okay. Yeah, charge shot's multi-purpose, man. That shit's fucked up. <laughs> it's a good move. Oh, I like that grab. Well, good forward there. That's a really strong option. The way it swings from the low hand, it's more likely to catch on a short hop out of field than other, like, other forward airs. It's swing like from overhead. Because it starts lower to the ground. It just feels good for like an option like that. Oh, now the tables have turned. Okay, he ditches his legend vulnerability. So taking the arc fire, Thoron's gone though. Oh, and yeah, then nice. Yeah, top of the arc fire now. There. Pretty, I wouldn't say a similar style of ledge trapping, but both of these characters have something that kind of like annoys the shit out of the other on the ledge. Right. I would say Arc Fire is probably more annoying than bombs, but I think that Kulish is just getting a lot more opportunities to position his bombs in the ledge than Midnight is, so it looks like it looks like his is uh, his worst feeling. And good stall. You really have to be patient with Samus when she's landing or recovering because she's gonna spend a lot of time in the air just kind of hovering on bombs. And if you if you cash them too early, then you're now in the worst situation against the character. Yeah, a couple times he can just kind of like just bomb his way back to like the middle of the stage. So yeah, he has surprisingly good carry. Like I know you see it in melee a lot. It's like a prime recovery. But it's not. It's not. I don't think it's as good in this game because you, know, you can't do the air, move, air dodge into Zare tether on the on the wall. But like it's still it's still not terrible. Yeah. Get up. We got a shield. That move is hard to di. Oh, that was so Ooh. slick. Good air dodge. Ooh, risky air dodge. Okay, hold Good punish. No. Nope. Oh, try to freak him out. He's still got Yo, a. He's, <laughs> he's currently he's lapped in percent and he's down a whole stop, so he's moving right now. But got to move a little bit more here. Oh, good stall. Oh, but oh, the double wow. swing, double swing, the classic. And now it's three stocks to one. Oh, point blank arc button there. He's having some trouble getting his position back. Okay, good oh, shot. Oh, wow. Kind of crossed him up there into the charge shot. That there almost raw killed him. There's the bomb. Waste the green. Charge shot's, like, really strong when it's fully charged, but the power between, like... Oh, skill throw. Okay. The power between fully charged and not fully charged is pretty wide, which is interesting because, like, most charge shots have this weird aspect to them where they're stronger before they're fully charged. Like nine wine, March right. Shield Breaker, stuff like that. But I don't think Samus has any like that with her, uh, her shot. Ooh, that was a read. All right, he went big. I was he down there. I think he just tried to down air that. And now he's got him on the ledge. Still down a whole stock, but you know if he can push this one out, he can definitely take. It. Oh no! Oh, oh he had an no! 11. Oh, he fell out! Oh no! Stuck at the jab. Steps back. Oh, raw Thor on across the stage. Gotta watch that eleven sword. That eleven aerial is probably gonna do him in. Good shot. Oh, good in air though to get back on. <laughs> Just across stage. Oh no, oh, got the roll nice. back. He's okay. He's okay. Thor He's going out nice catch. up there, yeah. Thoron will not cause the kill screen because it does not work properly with the kill screen. So you'll never see the kill screen on that move. Let's see. Oliver, I think my cut just healed, so we play. Should we play? We this set or whenever you want. Yeah. We'll play whenever. We're going to have a Roy did it. Great. <laughs> Alright, goodbye. Goodbye. Have fun. Enjoy your man in red hair. And now we go to game three. Where at though? I didn't catch the stage. Same characters? Yep, same characters. Game three. Alright. Same stage, okay, okay. No DSR, you can do whatever you want here. Oh no, okay, so that was actually. That was a good setup. He tried to mint shield with Arc Fire, but he turned it the wrong way. And now, unfortunately, it has become this game again on the ledge 
Defense Arc Fire. Which one do you think is more powerful when the opponent is on the ledge? Uh, I actually want to say Robin, but I just think that Coolster has gotten more situations That's where he gets this. Right? Yeah, right, yeah. Because, like, Arc Fire. Maybe it's because I just have more experience dealing with Arcfire at the ledge than Samus ledge trapping because yeah. of uh, because of my own experience. But like Arcfire just feels like a really really strong option to cover ledge, right? You On the just... ledge, I would describe Samus's Morph Ball bombs as obnoxious. Yes. But, like each one does like ten. They do before before, before, before before standing at least. Yeah. But Robin's Arc file is fucking impossible. <laughs> Unless you have an up e that doesn't put you in free fall and your name is not Snake, uh, so that leaves Mega Man, Sonic, and Banjo, then you really have no way to deal with it. You just kind of have to accept it. Yeah, you're either taking the hit, which honestly is and probably, exactly, which is probably the best option, or you're rolling in. And you don't want to roll in on it in case they, they catch that. Yeah. But when Arc Fire into Arc Fire and Arc Fire is like a good ledge trap, it kind of speaks volumes to how good the move is. Oh, ran into the book! He's okay, he's okay. He, he tried to take advantage of that book hit. He took a look at edge guard. It was in a book. I don't think he wanted to take that look though. Oh, good grab. I, I didn't even notice, but maybe he's on his second stock right now. Yeah. Currently it's a reversal of the last game where he has been lapped in percent and down a whole stock. Great shot to get him off the ledge there. Dealing with the arc fire really well. Yeah, that's another, that's another I, I way. If you have that. if you have a, a projectile that will not plank with arc file, then that's one way to deal with it. Because that'll get him out of the ledge. Good catch on the roll with the down smash. Good covers. Yeah. So I noticed that uh, you know Samus has loved to do the jab grab, right? Right. And you know it's even though you know it's coming, it's very easy to fall into the shield trap. But I see that Holster is not like he's not just going for the immediate grab after the jab. He's kind of like delaying his option, kind of trying to see what his opponent's doing. Mm. And he's not really getting anything out of it right now. But like just the when he does oh shit like God. that. Yeah. Right? Well, because like, like, why would you want to challenge that? That's it, a great option. Exactly. Like, yeah, is he gonna shoot or not? And the longer that you have, you wait, the worse that your shield gets, and then the bigger his shot gets. It's, too. it's it's either going to poke or it's going to break the shield. You have to make a decision, but you don't want to. You want him to move first. That's just how like the meta and the oh, that's nice. He's got him no, no jump. But he's got bombs. Yeah. All right. He just he didn't he didn't want to pull anything crazy there. He went back in position. Good catch. There you He's go. really so, pulling this yeah, one back. They got him to the ledge twice, and he took 100% total. Wow, that was a very ballsy jump. He, uh. just, he just he just double jumped back on the stage while charge shot was near full capacity. Yeah, at that point, he either had up B or just like air dodge up to get around it. Oh, good wait, good wait. Nice there, shot. Oh, that should. Cool. No, he's not dead. Okay. He didn't have a jump. Didn't want, to, didn't want to go too crazy. There's the bomb. A little more percent. Another bomb. Suck him on the ledge. Alright. Down air for it. Yeah. Oh, okay. And that killed. Came down way too aggressive with that down air. Alright. I I didn't think that would kill. There was no anything on that. It didn't even look like bad DI. Like he, was, he, didn't, he didn't go straight up. He had two-thirds rate.